In this part, we are going to introduce you the prototype. First, we can copy the code from the previous lecture and then paste here. We are going to delete this console.log. When using prototype, we mainly extract these functions outside this constructor. The reason of doing this is to save some memory. Because by using this method, we will be creating duplicate functions every single time. If we create two or three objects, this is not a big problem, but if we create a lot of objects, we will start seeing our memory growing because of each of these will create the same method again and again. For example, we can demonstrate this by console.log Peter functions and also Allen functions. You will see they are not the same, although actually they have the same functions, which demonstrate or imply this function create again. So if we console.log Peter dot calculate age equal 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 Alan dot calculate age it will display force so it implied they are not the same function they actually create this function again. So now we are introduced to use the prototype to solve this problem. For example, we can use person dot calculate age. We can copy from here dot prototype dot calculate age. And then we can delete this one. Now you can see it display the same value. It implies Peter and Alan will not create the same function again. They are using the same functions. And we can also test whether it works. Now you can see it also can calculate the age of Peter. So this is why we need to use the prototype.